Okay, this is how you take a binary number and change it into a decimal number. Okay, so what we've done is to change it from a binary to a decimal, you make this little table with your decimal numbers here and the numbers just double. One doubled is two, two doubled is four, four doubled is eight, etc. And you go all the way up to 128. Okay, we're then going to take each of the questions A, B, C, D, and we're just going to put them down here. Look, A, one, 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 one. So this is B, this is C, this is D, and this is E. Okay. Then to work out for A, what this binary number, one, 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 would be in decimal, if there's a one here, you add the number that's above it. So I add one to two and to four to give me seven. Four plus two plus one, seven. Do the same with B, let's do it a different color. So looking at B now, one, one, zero, zero, one, zero. So because this is a zero, I ignore the one. But because this one is a one, I take two, ignore this, ignore this, another one, 16, and another one, 32. So I would do 32 plus 16 plus 2, which is 50. Okay, we'll do one more. So I'm doing C now. There's a 1 here, so I'll take 1. Let's clear all this out and do this one more time. Here we go. There's a 1 here, so I'll take 1 plus 2. Not this one. Plus 8. Not this one. Plus 32. It would be 43. Okay, so just to show you the answers to all of these, so you can double check them against yours. 7, 50, 43, 139, and 254.